We know what a wristwatch is, and we know what it does. But have you ever thought when the first ever wristwatch came into existence? A man named Abraham Louis Brigue, after being commissioned by the Queen of Naples to make two unusual watches, conceived the first ever wristwatch in the world. On the 8th of June 1810, the Queen of Naples, Caroline Murat, sister of Napoleon Bonaparte, orders two unusual watches, a grand complication carriage watch for 100 louis, plus a watch for a bracelet with minute repeater for which she was quoted the price of 5,000 francs. This order is confirmed in Brigitte's manufacturing register. In Paris, where the historic archives of Maison Brigitte are preciously conserved, the register of commissions, as they were already known, lists the special orders placed by customers. The Queen of Naples's order later became known as Brigitte Watch Number 2639 and was finally completed on December 21, 1812. On March 8, 1849, Countess Responi had sent watch number 2639 for repair. The Countess Louise Murat, born March 21, 1805, was the fourth and last child of Joachim and Caroline Murat. It was again brought in for repair in 1855, which was the last trace Brigitte has of it. Today, the Queen of Naples' watch is nowhere to be found. The watch remains untraceable and no public or private collection lists the watch on its inventory. Unfortunately, no sketch of the watch has been found in the archives. Nevertheless, it is known that Abraham Louis Brigue made the world's first wristwatch for the Queen of Naples. At this point, we would like to thank the Swatch Group, Brigue.com and NNOPH.com. You can check out their links at the end of the video. Please don't forget to like and share this video, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you won't miss any updates. Once again, this is In The Know, thank you and thanks for watching.